Uh, I'm going to show you now how to prepare um, water, a solution of, uh, of water and uh, apple cider vinegar, uh, or a sour solution uh, which is uh, use, uh, useful in uh, combating uh, crop candida in birds. Uh, and uh, I'm going to show you also how to administer it using the crop feeding me method. Um, uh, okay. So first, uh, how to prepare the solution. In order to be effective against Candida, it, it has to be very sore, almost as uh, sore as to uh, cause you um, distress when you drink it. So I have here a water, is a uh, spring water. Tap uh, water is not good if you, if you want also to give uh, probiotics because the chlorine in the tap water uh, kills the, the good bacteria. So I'm going to give uh, to the bird a relatively small amount of uh, solid water no more than uh, 6 ml because uh, putting too much water in a bird's crop uh, may cause uh, uh, this water to come into mouth and uh, enter trachea then lung lungs and uh, suffocate the bird so only 6 ml but because I'm going to test it uh, I'm going to put a little more I'm going to put uh, the vinegar. This, uh, as I have to put only a small uh, amount, I'm putting uh, first um, in the cover, and then uh, put a little, taste it. And I think this is a little much too sore. I'm putting more water. No, it's insufficiently sore. I think now is the the proper concentration. I have put it back in the syringe and uh, <coughs> I'm covering the bottle with the uh, vinegar bottle. And uh, because it's a bird that uh, has an enteritis and drinks a lot of water. First, I'm going to extract that water uh, and uh, to let only the solid water in the crop because uh, uh, if I combine the water that already is in the crop with the sore water, the soreness uh, will uh, lose, will uh, get diluted and uh, will, no, will, be not, uh, will not be more efficient. So first I'm going to extract that water and I'm going to use a larger tube because uh, if there is uh, there are uh, candida clothes in the crop as I expect uh, a larger tube, uh, tube uh, will absorb uh, them uh, better in better way. So I'm going to attach this uh, this um, uh, larger tube uh, to an empty syringe. And as a lubricant, I can use uh, this water 
or I can use uh, some uh, paraffin, uh, liquid paraffin, or also called paraffin oil. I'm going to use both with this occasion. Pa uh, uh, liquid paraffin is also a good uh, when uh, there are uh, geyser blockage blockages and in order to decongestion the the geyser. So I put an amount of uh, liquid paraffin in this syringe. And now I, I'm going to catch the bird. This is a bird. So I uh, palpate the crop as uh, as expected. Uh, there is uh, too much water inside. I first have to extract that water. Because it's a, a large tube uh, and may not enter easily. I'm lubricating the mouth and the, the throat with few drops of uh, liquid paraffin. And also, I'm going to lubricate uh, the tube with water. And now, when introducing the tube, uh, the main concern is to avoid any forced uh, movement. Uh, if the tube uh, doesn't slide uh, by itself inside, uh, um, down to the throat, uh, stop and uh, pull out and try again. Don't force it at all because if you force it at all, you you cause harm to the throat wall and this. You can even uh, cause uh, hemorrhage and death. It's very, it's a very great uh, danger. It uh, needs uh, many time, uh, tens of times to use the crop feeding method uh, to come to the point when you uh, know by intuition uh, the sort, uh, the way the space uh, along the throat is and uh, how to. Uh, guide the tube in order to slide uh, um, easily inside. The tube must enter, uh, must be around uh, 20 centimeters or uh, nine, nine uh, inches, and must enter most uh, on, with uh, most of the its uh, length uh, inside the bird, as you can see. And now, very slightly, I'm going to pull the piston of the syringe up and uh, extract the liquid. If you feel uh, that uh, uh, the tr the crop wall, because uh, the tube has reached the crop um, is uh, get is, uh, has got uh, stuck to the tube uh, tube tip and um, it, uh, the piston um, um, is, you cannot uh, pull the piston then stop it uh, don't force it because uh, you also can cause uh, harm to the, the uh, to the mucosa of, of the of the crop In this uh, case, as you can see, we can extract the liquid. I 
I extracted around uh, 8 milliliters and thus uh, I was afraid there is candida, there are some small clots in this water but I extracted most of the water in the crop and now I can uh, put the salted water I'm attaching a, a, a tube to the syringe, another tube. This uh, tube uh, can be thinner and it's good to be thinner because uh, it causes uh, less stress to the bird and less harm to the truck wall. I also lube the tube uh, with uh, water. When I reach the, the, uh, the bottom of the crop, I'm starting to push the, the piston uh, down. Okay. This bit has uh, saved uh, the crop, the um, solid water.